Hey there, what's that? You like collecting video games? And you have way too much money? Well, have I got some suggestions for you. Come here, come here son, look at this. Oh, I'm sorry, this copy of GoldenEye 007 for the N64 just sold for under $3,900. Quite a deal, but way below your pay grade. Let's see what else we have for you. There's this copy of Final Fantasy VII, brand new factory sealed for just under $4,000. What do you say? Only $15 shipping also, I mean. No, no, okay, not good enough. How about Bomberman 64, only $5,000, or excuse me, $49.99.99, plus $19.99 shipping. It's, it's a steal, no? All right, I see your big, big baller. Oh, I'm sorry, this, this copy of Super Mario Land just sold for $5,000. I know, free shipping too, it was such a good deal. Moving on, we have plenty more where this came from. How about, oh, you know, this one just sold too, I'm sorry, Pokemon Yellow. Great game, fifty-three hundred dollars plus five dollars shipping. Oh, uh, just missed that one. I'm sorry. Oh, you also missed this copy of Duck Hunt for the NES, fifty-five hundred dollars. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's see. Let's see what we do have in stock. Oh, we don't have Chrono Trigger. That one just sold for fifty-nine ninety-nine. That's fifty-nine hundred ninety-nine dollars. Five thousand, six thousand dollars for this game after shipping. Six thousand fourteen dollars. Oh my goodness. Oh, we also just sold this Super Mario Kart for $8,300. I, I can't even, can't, can't even keep character. This is insane. But no, no, this is just the beginning. You have no idea. Legend of Zelda NES for nine, uh, from 1987, factory sealed, $8,600. We're getting there, we're getting there. But this is still just the tip of the iceberg, just you wait. All right, we've got Pokemon Fire Red version for the Game Boy Advance, only $10,000. You could finance it though. You could finance it for only $481, $481 a month for 24 months. You know, some people might finance a car for that amount, but I'm thinking Pokemon is way more important than transportation. I mean, that's just me. Moving on. Brand new sealed Legend of Zelda a Link to the Past for the Super NES, $15,000. Again, you can finance it for $721 a month for 24 months. I mean, it, that really makes it a lot more manageable. If, if Zelda isn't your style, you can pick up the original Grand Theft Auto for the PS1, only $15,000. So you can take your pick. You want Zelda, you want GTA, are you a SNES guy or a PS1 guy or gal? choice is yours. If, if neither one of those are your style, if you have more money to spend than that, you might want to check out this Nintendo 64 Complete First Print Rareware Collection. You're looking at 11 games here. You got GoldenEye. You got... Oh, remember how much GoldenEye sold for earlier? You could get 11 games for only 20 Gs. You got GoldenEye, Perfect Dark, Conquer, Jet Force Gemini, Banjo-Kazooie and Banjo-Tooie, Donkey Kong 64, and more. What a steal, guys. 20k? There's no financing, though. You're going to have to have to get a loan, or you're going to have to reach into those, those money sacks of yours. That's uh, no problem for you. If this is a chump change, well, check it out. Sonic the Hedgehog, first print Sega Genesis, 24 dollars I mean, if you ask me, that's that's well worth it. Two viewed per hour. This is a hot item. Uh, you 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 might need to move fast on this one. How about this? Super NES, Super Nintendo, uh, Ninja Turtles, Four Turtles in Time. Actually, classic, very good game. Well worth thirty thousand dollars, if you ask me. But that's just me. I mean, um, you know, I'll give you guys a couple of days if you want to jump on this. Um, if not, I just might have to pick this one up uh, I, I think i'm gonna add this to my watch list okay oh or or you could get a collection of three ninja turtles games for the game boy for thirty two thousand nine hundred ninety nine dollars hmm i'm gonna have to go with the snes game i'm sorry but you might want to check this one out one viewed per hour oh michael J who's a michael jackson fan up in here you could get Michael Jackson's Moonwalker for the Sega Genesis for the low price of $34,999. Uh, 
Uh, is this with free shipping? It is fast and free shipping. You gotta hop on this one. Hot item, three viewed per hour. I wonder how many people are just watching, who, who are viewing these games just because it's so ridiculous. And how many people are seriously thinking about dropping this cash? I don't know, there's some wealthy collectors out there for sure. Um, yeah, this is insane. Super Mario Bros. Factory sealed for the NES. $35,000. This one sold. This one recently sold. $35,000. But hey, it was free shipping. Uh, I mean, I, yeah. I, I can't imagine having that kind of money to spend on a collector's item like this. It's a great collector's item, for sure. Original Super Mario Bros. game for the NES. 35 Gs! Come on! That's like how much a normal person earns in a year. Not a normal person, but you know what I mean. A lot of people make a lot less than that in a year. By normal, I meant average, okay? Well, for average single income in the States is probably around 35 grand. Anyways, moving on. Check this out, Mega Man. Oh, this one sold to $41,100. Mega Man first print for the NES, brand new and sealed. This is insane, guys. $41,000. We're getting there. We're getting up there to the tippy top. We're getting to the... The finale here it's only gonna get higher and higher wow check this out Superman round black seal Nintendo NES sealed mint $50,000 for the Superman game $50,000 my goodness okay moving on it gets better guys it gets better Mega Man Game Boy Collection, five games for $60,000. Honestly, after seeing a single game at $50,000, $60,000 for five games seems like a bargain. There's something very wrong with that, but it seems like a bargain. Look at that, well, $44 shipping, I think that's a deal breaker though, honestly. No, but for real, if you're selling something for $60, something so small to ship, don't you want to just throw in some free shipping? I mean, honestly. Is it really cutting into your margins that much at that point when you're earning $60,000 on a sale? Okay. So I'm I'm not good at sales. Okay. Moving on. I think we hit the we, we hit the final we hit the jackpot here. We hit the final highest listing I could find on a video game. Slalom for the NES brand new sealed 1985. I, I'm just speechless, guys. $400,000. I could buy you two houses in another state, not in California. That could buy you one if you're lucky. $399,999.99 plus $13.65 shipping. Kill me now, guys. Just, just kill me now. Uh, I don't know what to say. This, this hasn't sold. Four viewed per hour. People just dropping their jaws, like just like me, like stunned. I don't know. Maybe it'll sell. This is insane. Twenty-five watchers. Twenty-five watchers. Are they watching because they want to buy, or are they watching just to see what it sells for? This is the stuff that intrigues me. I don't know what to say. I don't know. All right, a couple of Easter eggs here. I saw this ridiculous thing somehow pop up on Google, and this kind of inspired me to make the video. Also, I've been seeing some some of these random things pop up on eBay, and I've been posting them on Instagram, just like, oh, what the heck is this? And then I saw this thing on Google, and I was like, five thousand six hundred ninety-five dollars for this tacky cheeseburger clutch. Almost six G's for this to have a hamburger a hamburger bag this this just left me speechless I, I don't even know I, I don't even know oh my gosh this is this this is a thing huh Judith Lieber look you can get a pizza bag no no thanks get a pizza bag <laughs> the way you hold it it's like you're just holding a slice of pizza it's all jewel encrusted oh my gosh 
Look at this bedazzled popcorn thing. Why? Why? There's a cupcake. It's about a thousand dollars cheaper. I I don't understand the world, guys. I I do not understand. Can somebody please explain this life to me? Anyways, I got one more for you though. It's not a video game. This is not a handbag, nor a clutch. Do you like Pokemon cards? Well, I've got the ultimate complete first edition factory sealed booster box collection. One million dollars. I'm done. I'm out. Now, to be fair, you get a lot of uh, a lot of cards in here, a lot of boxes. Look at this. And yes, yes, some of these are very. Actually, no, these are all very rare, of course. Look at this, you got 1, 2, 3, 4, 7, 5, 32, 32 first edition booster boxes. <sighs> million dollars. Who's going to buy this for a million dollars? That's what I want to know. How many millions of dollars do you make in a year to buy this thing? A lot of us will never make a million dollars in our lives. I, I don't know, guys. I, I don't know. Free shipping though, you gotta give them that. Thank you, thank you for the free shipping. You're a decent person. I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm out guys. Thanks for watching, like, comment, subscribe. See you next time.